Hi guys, we Bob here, and today we're going to talk about Rebel 7 and the fact that there's a massive sale on at the moment. If we go over to their website, you can see that they have it down the standard version for $9.99, or for the full version, the pro version, $14.99, or in UK it's pounds, it just seems to translate straight across. But they have used the dollar sign in their, their banner, so I'm presuming in America it will come up as dollars as well. They've also got a couple of creative packages. Flame Painter, Amber Light, which I have used in the past. I've got a, a few of them downloaded. I might put them on the screen for you to see. But yes, the sale is on just now. I'm doing this video in two parts so that I can cut off this beginning when the sale ends. But what is it about the package? Well, it comes with, it's just the painterly feel. It's a painterly package. If you like traditional painting and you don't have the room in your house for all the paints and you don't have the mess, and you've got a decent enough PC and I'll put the minimum recommended requirements on the screen. Uh, I've got a powerful PC but the thing is the price of uh, graphics cards and all that are coming down. So a kind of mid-level PC is probably going to cut it. Now uh, I've got a... I'll put, again I'll put up my specification of my PC on the screen. But yes it's going to start working on a lot more affordable PCs now as a graphics card increase in power and then you can get that watercolour simulation working really well for you. So what does Rebel do for you? Rebel brings in a bunch of tools that you have available to you. Uh, first of all if we just looked at it we can see they've got oil paintings which give you the nice impasto effect and then especially if you add the metallic layer in you get these metallic Beautiful brush strokes giving you the reflectivity which you can lock or you can move it around the screen as I'm showing you here. One of the great things is when you've used the impasto you can add the watercolour in and you'll get this great effect where it's like a mountain range moving around. It's like one of those topographical images you see on a map and you can start manipulating it with the, the blowing tool and getting those drips flying off in all directions, getting that metallic look. Uh, it's just very... Uh, you can just play with it for hours doing absolutely nothing or you can knuckle down and draw something that you really really want to draw and you want to get that traditional feel to it, you want to get that traditional look as you can see from some of these examples I'm showing you on the screen. So the watercolours are amazing, you can change the simulation effects, you can do layer masks which are another great feature. Another feature that they've got and added in, I think it was Rebel 6, was the liquify tool so you can see the, li the liquify tool here i've got a few videos going into this in great depth on my channel but let's say we want to make her eyes a wee bit smaller we can do that and it really changes the look to the drawing so you might have got to the end of your drawing you may be halfway through and you're thinking oh i don't really like that and rebel gives you all the tools to change how your image looks But there's also these other tools such as structures which will let you let the water kind of flow through them and it'll take on some of the shape it doesn't really take on and you've got stencils which is a bit more rigid gives you that nice control over what it is you're trying to imprint onto the paper i have done a few things recently i've had a few things printed off i've got a poster of a Spider-Man drawing I was working on, I sent that off to a friend, I did a wee video on that as well. And it does, it comes out beautiful, especially if you're going through Photobox or something like that, get yourself a nice matted poster print. And if you want me to do a video on printing and see the prints that I've made, let me know in the comments, that would be appreciated. Uh, like and subscribe and all that stuff. But it's just beautiful, I mean, you can just see for yourself from these examples how traditional this paint package looks and if you're like me like I've said you've not got the room this really brings that into one place you can do your painting without all the mess you can get it printed off yes it's not going to be quite the same but it's kind of like any prints that you might have ever done a print is never going to have those brush strokes and the thickness of the paint so these it's just as it's a beautiful piece of software and if you get it for a price that's decent then go for it if you've got a powerful enough pc like i said so what else have we got we've got pencils we've got charcoal which we can get some really lovely i love using the charcoal brushes we've then got these burn and dodge brushes which can help us without really affecting the painting or the drawing 
they can help us just darken parts down, get the picture to pop that bit more. We've got filters that we can use to change the colorization of the picture. It is just overall a fantastic piece of software. Some very odd looking shapes and it's a bit like the happy accidents that, that Bob Ross talked about. The, using this software gives that capability. Whereas I have done a few videos recently on Sketchbook Pro where I'm not getting the control. I don't have the enjoyment of those accidents happen. You've got to be very precise with Sketchbook Pro and it's not really conducive to the way I work. So yeah, um, there is plenty of videos on my channel if you want to go and check them out. I'll leave a few at the end of this video. Thank you very much for watching and Wee Bob is out. Thank you. Bye.